hello everyone in our previous video we have discussed about advanced setup and today i will show you how we can set up basic implementation and i have shown few things related to advanced setup as well as i let you know that in the advanced setup there is some there are some limitation and because one thing is the advanced setup is only work for google related product as well as the advanced setup numerous privacy experts have raised the concern about this setup and they are not agree with the google internally filled allowed data based on the provided consent so if we like to change our advanced setup to basic setup what you need to do let's we do that thing so i am switching back to my google analytics in our previous setup we have changed by clicking this icon and we have selected all of the google product and we give the no additional consent required so we have selected this way as well as we have chosen no additional consent required this way from not set to no additional consent required and then today we need to change the thing so for the consent for the ad related consent with the tag which is related to ad that cases we need to change as well as uh, as well as the analytics tag we need to change few things so right now i am selecting all of the tag which is related to google which is related to analytics so ga4 as well as the all the ga4 related tag these are the related to analytics and i am clicking this icon and you will see require additional consent for tag fire and i am giving the consent name the analytics storage so when we have analytics storage consent that case is this those tag only fire if we don't have consent for analytics storage then this selected tag will not fire just save it and we also do same thing for ad related tag so i am just selecting ad related tags this is the ad related tag as well as the facebook related pixel related tags and of course there is a conversion linker is related to ad so i have selected all tag which is related to ad and now we need to click this icon and then we need to click require additional consent for tag to fire and then we need to choose it uh, add storage like this as well as if you like you can select anything which is ally in your rules and regulation you also can select those things but my case is the add storage is perfectly fine and as i need to save it now i am going back to my google tag manager preview and now if i preview the thing again by clicking the preview button in the top right corner and in this stage right now i don't have any consent for anything and if we check our google analytics preview and i let i like to let you know that i have already cleared the cookie where the consent related thing is saved now i am checking the preview you see that right now we don't have any consent actually we have the default consent but everything is denied add storage is denied as well as the analytics storage is denied and this is the initialization here the tag ga4 config and facebook preview supposed to fire but uh, those two tag does didn't fire because of tag block by consent setting and if i click here you will see the not fire due to missing consent because to fire this tag it is required to have consent for good analytics that means it's required to enable this analytics settings enabled 
as well as the facebook related tech facebook page view didn't fire this is because it also don't have an app uh, consent not fired due to missing consent it required the consent is add storage but we don't have any consent for this so that's why those two tags didn't fire but if i allow all here and reload the page and just i'm going to connect it again and this is this we have permission for all of the thing add storage as analytics storage and if we check this page again maybe we can check here you see that right now the ga4 config as well as page view everything is firing perfectly now if we go to a internal page for example the clothing page and from here if we like if we go to any of the product page this is the product and right now we are expecting couple of view item event so if you come here and say which tag has been fired we see that the page view and facebook page view page, facebook view count as well as we can see that g4 config and this one is g4 view item actually this is the single product page and this page there is an additional event the event name is view item this is the view item event from google tag manager and this stage we see that two tag fire one is facebook view content this is related to ad and this is analytics view item this is related to google analytics now if i clear everything here right now and give a reload so that we can get the consent pop up again now in this stage look here if we give consent for marketing only and allow selection and if we reload the page and check what actually happened and right now we if we click uh, this actually we need to go to the single product page again this is the single product page and right now we only have consent for analytics we can check it by clicking here again you see that right now we only have consent for actually marketing related consent and if we go back here and if we check the view item here we see that we are getting event which is related to marketing and this is facebook view count and this tag is not re related to marketing and this is the in analytics that's why this tag didn't fire and you see that the tag blocked by consent setting and if we check here it's require additional consent the additional consent is analytics storage and if we check the consent uh, you will see that we don't have this consent this con consent is denied but the add storage consent is allowed now if i click everything here and click the clear the cookie consent and reload it again and if i uh, and this is this if i only allow the statistic that is related to google analytics and and if i keep the marketing not allow and if i click the allow selection this way and again if i clear everything and reload the page right now in this stage we only have consent for our google analytics so uh, but we don't have consent for google ad at any ad related consent so if by going back to our our google tag manager preview and if i select here and right now you see that we only have consent for google analytics history but we don't have any any consent for add storage and right now if i switch back to text and now we see that the ga4 ga4 view item tag has fired but this facebook view content view content tag 
has not fired due to lack of consent not fair due to missing concept so this way we can configure our settings so these cases if this is called the basic setup in the basic setup when we have proper consent that case is only the tag will be fired and if we don't have proper consent for any tag then that tag will not fire marketing related tag only fire when we have con proper consent for marketing related thing and the analytics related tag only fire when we have consent for analytic related consent so this is uh, about the basic setup actually basic setup is a setup in in a single word when no consent no tag fire but in this implementation it is perfectly fine every page uh, right now what it will work perfectly but in the basic setup in this stage we have a very big problem this problem i will discuss about in the next video thank you very much